Hey Blakers, what's going on? Hey man, I got your um, your body blank all glued up. Uh, it's looking good. This uh, particular piece of spalt was a little bit challenging in the um, in the book match department. I had to do a little bit of a slip match, but we got it. We got it pretty close. Um, but the headstock is not being so kind to me, so let me. Let me show you a couple of things here. Um, basically, let me see if we can get to the edge of this. If you look on this black line, the way that it angles out, as the piece, and this one's at a really hard angle, and this one's at not so much of an angle. So you can see as you sand through the, you know, wood it, actually the lines are going to travel across so typically like in a, in a situation with a top like this when you slice it open with a bandsaw and do the book match uh, you just want to take the saw marks off and you don't want to sand anymore and then you still have to do a little bit of a slip match to catch it uh, this is not the slip match that's where I purposely whacked it but down here it, it was off you know just an eighth of an inch I had to push one side up just to get things to line up. But on this, um, there was a bunch of cracks and splits in this, um, so I actually had to uh, do a lot of heavy sanding on both sides. I was going to do a one piece, see if what you thought about a one piece headstock. I don't know if you can see the, uh, the lines I've got on there. Um, and I thought that would be cool because that kind of puts this right down the middle. Um, if you can't see the lines, that's that's where they're at but anyway I, I was able to get enough out of these two pieces to form a reasonable book match and again they were a book match but half half the heavy heavy sanding they walked apart so basically what I was thinking about doing here let me see if I can figure out what I did uh, buh, 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 buh. yeah this is my match Okay, so that was the um, the book match there. Now, because the line crept one way or the other, we lost a little bit of space. Um, actually, on this side, this line is very diagonal. On this end, it's not. So it traveled more on this side than it, you know, the gap got wider over here, and it got closer on this side. So basically, what I'm going to do is fold this up, slip match it just a little bit, and then, if you can see here, pencil. I'm basically going to line up these guys, and then on the top, I'm going to kind of slip it over and kind of get a match like that on both sides. You can see I've already drawn the box, so I'm going to cut it. And then what I'm thinking is I'm going to go use this as my center line right here, and I'm going to do a bandsaw straight up here and then edge this then I'll be able to fold that out into a match um, basically if the only reason why I'm getting so detailed in this is because I know you're extremely into it and if you were still here working with me you'd be going through all this stuff with me but you can see that's a pretty a pretty good portrait now naturally we're only going to have that much meat on either side but if you can just bring those together in your imagination that's what I'm going to do um, and basically although this is not the book match side um, I've got this is not a mirror so it's not going to be very reflective at all and I don't know if you can get any of that at all I'll just turn it real slow and see if you can get any. But that's the book match that I'm going for. It's going to give us a little bit of the white, a lot of the brown, and just a shade of the uh, maple on the out, maple color on the outside. But that's that's what I'm going for, sport. If you got any ideas other than that, call me. I've got some other um, some other spalted that just doesn't match, and it's really fragile this junk here man it was stupid because um, it just wants to fall apart 
and it doesn't really match. I mean, although it's beautiful, there's nothing in your instrument that's like that. So anyway, if you agree, let me know. If you disagree, shut it. No, I'm just kidding. No, let me know, buddy. It's your, it's your baby. All right, see you. Bye.